And I am Edvard Lumiere, the famous inventor. You've probably used one of my products, and if you haven't, well, I pity you. <laughs> but I did you, win! Yeah, um, you should see the other great. woman. Successful yeah. mission. Because she can't see you. Capital. Zilla, um, I, have it, I have this electric hat that uh, can reduce swelling around the, uh, the eyes and face, if you would just like to place this on your head. I haven't quite ironed out all the kinks, but I think it. <laughs> no, no, no. It's if it works. It, with, gr- with great ease, I physically hold. It's terribly dangerous if you him, I, I if you struggle. At arm's length. <laughs> it's a lot more dangerous if you. Uh, all right. Would you say the coat oh. is ruined, Edvard? I'm saying the coat is ruined. The coat yeah. is absolutely ruined. Again? Coat is, yeah. Oh my god! Every time. All right. This well, I'll carry this. This is his latest favouritest coat. Is it his eyes and teeth and oh, tongue? Oh, I'm hoping it's not eyes and teeth and tongue. I'm betting fingers. Fingers. Uh, I mean, he, okay, had two, well, he had two ears, didn't he? Probably could be one of them in there as well. You want yeah. in on this action? You it's want probably to bet one of all bundle? of the spare bits that he's got. So mm. an ear, one of the fingers, maybe a kidney. No one's bet on organs yet, Lilith. Yeah, could be a kidney in there. Yeah, could be. Oh, God. It's Barnaby's whole forearm. <gasps> um, severed and bleeding oh. freely. Identifiable by uh, a family ring. I start building a wonderful mechanical We there. We would... <laughs> I really think you're overthinking this, I say to Lilith, as I place a bucket on top of a broomstick and draw Barnaby's face on it. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt, are you all using all of your hair? Rum Barnaby. No, it's not there. Um, <laughs> look, we're all thinking it, I'm going to say it. What if he just tells us where the money is and we leave him? The note says we'll get him back. Oh, so we go find out from him where the money is, go get it, and then go get... Just wait for coin. him to be posted. Huh. Oh, we'll get the ten coin. That's, yeah, that's, no, that's what I meant. <laughs> the wonderful mechanical man cannot... It has some sort of consciousness, incredibly. Um, maybe, a, maybe a ghost fell into it or something um but but <laughs> all, all it, caught up in the cogs yeah all it can all it can do at the moment all the all, all version one can do is scream and ask to die oh. um but yes it's certainly more of a wonderful mechanical man than any of you were expecting to be constructed here behold oh. i say i'm not sure how wonderful this yeah, is yeah you've made an abomination i mean it could be a pretty good approximation of what barney's saying right now so it's very dark, but it's... <laughs> behold! It, it's a sort of grating, rusty. Jesus! All right, kind of I, I twist its head off. No, oh, <laughs> that was a breakthrough in automaton science. Yeah, then uh, it, it was a break off in yet, automaton hey, science. Yeah. If we were it's to time Monday our... and Saturday because nothing is as it seems in the <laughs> mansion. Yeah. Imagine like a wet room, but like mm. a, yeah. a very bad wet room. Wet room. <laughs> yeah, the floor kind of sloops, sl- uh, sl- slopes down. Material everywhere. to sluice through for processing. <laughs> processing, and clay, yeah. Putting most of your effort into like the actual <laughs> hand blocking part of this. <laughs> uh, okay, well we need we need him to not scream because no, otherwise oh, honestly this I say as I pour some ether into a rag <laughs> <laughs> just cool all right um so yeah you're just ethering him yeah. Edvard no need to roll for that he's tied down he can't possibly resist no rag him rag cool the ether is administered <laughs> uh and he yeah he sort of he goes briefly cross-eyed and is sort of you know oops sorry shh Keep it down. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I came here to study ghosts, not become one. I think how much study you could do if you did become one. <laughs> Let's just get the pens. information out of... I feel like if he were conscious, he would be loudly complaining. So let me... Can we hear any loud you don't, complaining? You don't hear any loud complaining. No. Mm-mm. Well, why don't we split up? <laughs> That's always a good idea. In the Let's haunted house. Yeah. yeah. Uh, All right. Hands in the middle. Yeah. Uh, and dead Barnaby. <laughs> <laughs> to think that we would have uh, one of the braces of Thogroth in our humble mansion. My goodness. What we will learn. And, and that's all. Okay. And then it sort of gets cut off. All right. Oh, okay. I grab her around the throat and choke her out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> cool. I think you're going to have to roll me for that as well. I leap towards her as she leaps basically over my shoulder. Yeah. And like wrap a wrap a bicep under her chin 
and just start like gentle but very very firm pressure yep. just trying to you know choke quietly choke her out cool nice um she kind of like s- tries to speak like you can hear her sort of like very faintly going Mia, Mia, Mia. but you do successfully choke her out and oh. she's not able to see see anything in the other bed um the kind of like form like under the covers kind of like kind of okay. like shut up leah uh, okay, this and, is fine and I, t- you know, I tuck her back into bed goes, so- goes back to sleep I gently put her like back in, yeah. put the cover back up, yeah. and make her look like you know smooth the hair, and she looks nice. like she's sleeping again. You can see two uh, figures in there, uh, who you recognise actually. It's Rosie and Josie. They look bored, and um, Rosie, let's say, says, um, "I almost like it better when he was screaming." Uh, and uh, the other says, "Yeah." <sighs> Why do we have to sit here and guard him? The door's locked, isn't it? And she just meets your eyes, Lilith. Just for a second. And goes, someone's watching us. Someone's in the portrait. Who's that? Who's there? Is that you, Nora? And she walks up. Starts, you know, she's investigating. Okay, I quickly go, yeah, it's me. Uh, You'll never catch me. Meet you in the kitchens and run. <laughs> <laughs> blissfully, blissfully unaware of everything that just transpired. Yes, uh, I was heading to the kitchens. Mm-hmm. That's oh, right. God. Oh God! Just gonna tip an entire vial of slumber essence into the stew pot. Nice. If there's sort of a little oven, I can push myself in and like. Yes. <laughs> climb in an oven. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Uh, very nice. Okay. Consider yourself bone charmed. Consider yourself. <laughs> Bone charmed. charmed. <laughs> Consider yourself meeting up after 10 minutes. Uh, yeah, so. Oh. And if you get the password wrong, not good things happen to you because of the ghost. Be a terrible distraction if that was a go wrong, wouldn't it? Mm. You all being killed by a ghost would be quite distracting. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, who wants to go and, and feed the wrong password to the terrifying sad ghost oh we've got our resident ghost whisperer here I say clapping <laughs> on the back uh huh yeah yeah I do. but we, we need we need to ideally it needs to be a pair and they're all sisters so Zilla I think you're kind of hey. brought in on this with me <laughs> they're very concealing these cloaks if you've got a razor no, 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 no. <laughs> Not falling for that again. <laughs> Coming anywhere all right, near. All right, all right, all right. It looks like a regular pistol bullet, except the cartridge cylinder bit uh, is actually clear. It's made of glass, uh, and there's, like, kind of it's sort of glowing faintly, something in there. I'm just sort awesome. of sketching it. Um, a, a flashback, I filed off the name Asta from, um, from the, <laughs> the cap. Wait, I can vaguely make out some. <laughs> oh, don't, wor- don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. That's the um, that's the used by date. Okay. Well, anyway, I've noted some improvements they can make. Oh, Sadie Usually. and Katie. Um. Oh, I actually, I actually found out Molly and Holly. That oh was yeah, the no, name Molly and Holly yeah, as well. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. They have quite um, a lot of outreach, Dimmer. Yeah. Sidebar: I was really looking forward to on on the fly having to come up with two <laughs> rubbish rhyming names. <laughs> I was working with Hannah and Spanner. <laughs> Jethro and Bethro. Billy and, Billy and Jimmy. <laughs> but it's much better that Lilith has pre-prepared some. Done it in a flashback. Aliases. Very, yeah. very nice. Good. Well done. So, so what was it? Holly and Molly. And Jennifer Molly. And yeah. <laughs> Cassandra and Cassandra. <laughs> <laughs> they have yeah. a light switch. I'd have thought they'd have a dimmer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a it's a twisty one. No, you're I'll, not. I'll go now. Yeah. He's not yeah. sorry. You better. <laughs> <laughs> I leave and start a new life elsewhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Why don't you have the password? Because we've just got back from assignment. Don't you know we're Molly and Holly, and we like to travel. We've not actually met you before, Molly and Holly, but we've heard of your daring exploits and exciting trips abroad yeah and have you heard of the things that we do if people don't do as we ask yes okay look as you can see we're sort of in the middle of something hold this where is she where is she uh, and they <laughs> and uh, Chloe Chloe just goes I hate it Silla's not very good at the sneaky sneaky stealthy 
stuff. So, um... Yeah, well, I mean... Uh, yeah, I choke Zoe to... unconscious and throw her in the storage cupboard. <laughs> <laughs> along with Chloe, and then lock them both in. Slips her bicep under her chin. Cool. <laughs> and drags her silently towards the cupboard and then hefts her in and slams the door. And Let's then make turns that all... to Lilith and says, yep. I'm sorry, I'm new at this. <laughs> <laughs> it's half man, half dog. Uh, there's a, Which a, half? Um, <laughs> the worst. It's the worst not one. That, <laughs> like a centaur. It's not that, it's not that <laughs> clear cut. Oh, okay. No. That's all I can say. It's okay. not... All right, I uh, turn to Lilith and say, well, your, your turn. Uh, <laughs> I'll lead it because Zilla's like, ghosts? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I'm like, ghosts. So you're sort of grabbing you're grabbing. I'm Zilla. grabbing yeah. Zilla. Yeah. Like... Just the dog man. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Who's a good yeah. ghost? Who's a good ghost? Who's cool. a good ghost? Go. What a mess we made. <laughs> we made together. <laughs> Both of us. <laughs> All right, someone roll me something. I will tell you that the um, immense success of that six is that your arms and legs aren't pulled off. So good. Whoa! Big, so Dead. big win. Um, that is a big so, win. So, my God, where am I? The last thing I knew, I was in bed with my wife. Where are my children? <laughs> Bones! <laughs> uh, where, what am I? Am I dead? My God! I... Bones! Bones! While it's attacking, attacking? While it's uh, all up in Lily's face, I shoot it point blank with the ectoplasmic revolver. Yep, cool. Roll me, roll me, roll me for that, Zilla. Zilla, oh, sorry, right. Yeah, that's you. I, yeah, no, 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 I know. I was just hoping Lilith could do it. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing as I'm not taking responsibility for my actions anymore. <laughs> uh, You've okay, made a well, conscious <laughs> choice to no longer be responsible for your actions. <laughs> personal reasons i will no longer be taking responsibility <laughs> as we um, as we go into the walls what i would like to do is get us to take off of our take off our robes uh-huh. and throw them into the middle of the room as if we've been disintegrated oh, nice very nice beautiful you see he's unconscious we can't talk to him like this we're gonna have to yeah, we're gonna have to right. take him out with us well why don't we just wake him up well be um. my guest old chap <laughs> <laughs> i limp over pick him up and and just whap <laughs> And then, just for a second, he's like, Casimir looks off in the distance and goes, <sighs> Oh, no, no, you're doing it all wrong, I say. And then I give him a backhanded cuff. I rejoin the, the queue. <laughs> uh, Squiffy? <laughs> yeah, mate. Is that me. you? Classic Squiffy. L- listen. Squiffy, I had the most go- awful dream. Yeah. I was kidnapped, you know. Something about hazing and classic japes. Yeah. Um... <laughs> And um, you sort of hear him say, My gosh, chat, those are some bloody nice shoes. I <laughs> press a <laughs> press a rag covered in uh, ether to his face. <laughs> is that you, Edvard? Whoa. <laughs> okay. I say, look, here he is, safe and sound, and then I notice I've left Barnaby face down in a puddle of blood, so I just sort of <laughs> nudge him cool. with my foot and roll him onto his What's back. What's he doing here? We were going to leave him. Yeah, well, it's... Nope. We haven't got much time. We're just trying to get out of here. We haven't got time to revive him and then question him. We can do it back at the base. Spring in, Pythons. All right. Well, let's sort Still through these through these ropes. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's there's just there's just about room. Um, but yeah. Edvard and I accidentally on purpose dip Barney in the sewage when we're getting him onto the gondola. <laughs> yeah. Just his hair and, and clothes and mouth. Sure. Uh, and face. Yeah. And, yeah. <laughs> 